Hi, this is Jason Penrose with the Penrose team at Remax Excalibur. Thanks for tuning into Jason Penrose TV. Today we're talking about a topic I'm actually addressing a lot. Sellers who want to sell their homes now, but they have concerns about the coronavirus. How do you make that happen? Stay tuned, we're gonna talk about it. Thanks again for tuning into Jason Penrose TV. So today we're talking about sellers who wanna sell their homes now, but they have concerns about the coronavirus. Now, let me be very clear. Um, it's very risky for someone to put their home on the market for sale if they're in one of the older categories, let's say 65 plus, they have pre-existing medical conditions as identified by many doctors as being high risk. In those scenarios, a lot of those sellers are better off probably not letting people into their homes. For someone who does not fall into the high risk category, but they still wanna sell their homes, what are some precautions that can be taken? So a lot of our clients who wanna sell their homes now have decided to you know, leave all the interior doors open so that the buyers don't need to touch the doors or the realtor showing the property. They leave all the lights on so no one's trying to find a switch to flip and touch that. They're leaving all the blinds and the drapes and the shutters open so there's a lot of light in the home so no one's reaching over to try to open up drapes and blinds to make the home show brighter. There's a lot of things you can do to make the home as show ready as possible so that the showing realtor and their buyers have really no reason to touch anything except the, interior, the exterior door to get into your home and any doors to go out to say the backyard. So you can wipe those, those doors down with a sanitizing wipe to clean them after you know, the showing. Of course, we always also suggest that none of our sellers be present for showings, right? So that the buyer and the realtor can walk around and openly talk about what they like or don't like about the property. So obviously there's social distancing between you and the buyer because you're not present for the showing as well. Some of our clients have gone as far as to buy um, ionizers and ozone machines to put in their home to sanitize the air. So there are a lot of things you can do to you know, limit your chances of exposure. Of course, I'm not a medical doctor. I'm not giving you any medical advice whatsoever. I'm just sharing with you what other sellers are doing to limit the risk of exposure, still show their home and still get it sold. And to kind of debunk any myths out there about this being a bad time to sell property, there's still over a thousand homes a day selling on average every 72 hours. So every 72 hours, about a thousand homes are going under contract. So it's about three to 350 homes a day. That's a lot. If you'd like more information on how to show your property and get it sold in these times, call me on my cell phone number, 602-738-9943. Make sure to share this video with friends or family. Look forward to hearing from you soon. Take care.